Beefed up security measures at Parliament House will be fast tracked following a second major breach in as many days. This time, protesters who yesterday hijacked Question Time were able to abseil down the front of the building and unfurl a banner. Charles Croucher reports. A sky high sit in. Dangling under the coat of arms and in water stained blood red, protesters take over Parliament's forecourt. Traffic stopped as police watch on, Green senators bringing chocolate and support. Laws are being broken. These people are courageous. Yesterday, protesters were carried from Parliament after gluing themselves to the furniture. The Senate today approving security upgrades, including 38 new CCTV cameras, a 2.6 metre fence on the grass ramps and fortification around other entrances. I think what you're planning is like putting barbed wire on the Opera House. As negotiators tried and failed to communicate... You don't want to talk to me? The threat of specialist police moving into position, enough to end the standoff. After almost four hours dangling the pair Clyde back over the banister and into the arms of police, this is the same group that disrupted Parliament yesterday and they say they'll do it again. You should be expecting widespread protests across Australia until the camps are closed. Moments later, it was over. <laughs> the abseilers released with their banner and a court date, protesters overwhelmed and apparently over the attention. Hey, Charles Croucher. Nine years.